a, a mink jacket. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, a little something, something. I don't know. Wait, wait. I'm, whatever. I'm no, 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 no. Oh, hey, 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 let me call you back. Let me call you back. Let me call you back. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? More house, dog, whatever. I'm on the treadmill with the mink on. I'm about to go get me some juice, bro. Because I'm like that. Man, we dog. That's my dog. I've been known him. Dog, I leave you for five minutes. Now you owe you. Oh, oh you oh, like exercise. Oh, let me, hey, let me, let me call Yo, you back. Dog, no, 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 no. Don't get off. Talk to us. You know one of my favorite songs was 100 Miles of Running, huh? I'm saying, okay, well, I'm, I'm, finished, Joe, I'm finished. Joe, I'm finished. I'm finished. Come on, this how y'all run up in Morgan State, huh? Run. I'm finished, man. Come on, Joe, you ain't shape, baby. Can I get off? Can I please get off? No, 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 Joe, come on. I want you it's to feel welcome. Okay, Watch okay, this one. Go up here. Want to go up here like they do in Maryland? Look, look, that's not right, Come on, man. Come you like on, man. that, huh? You want to get off? Come on, off? man. All right, all right, I feel you, dog. Let me get off, man. All right, Joe. My fault, my fault, my fault. My bad, my bad, my bad. I mean, I know I'm pushing. I know I'm pushing. I know I'm pushing. I know I'm pushing. My fault. I'm going to go put it back, all right? Uh, look like you broke my trailer, man. I ain't break the trailer. That was broke before I got here. Uh, it was like that before I got here. What's back here on the Rap City, Joe Cleese. Uh, abusing Mr. Serve on house. I'm about to get kicked out of here. I hope it's I hope it's still on love. You know what I'm saying? All love. You know that. You know it's all, all, all love, all love. Yeah. Uh, how you avoid or what are you doing? Did you take steps to avoid the sophomore things for this new album and make sure that that you you know they build the hype of them and they don't live mm -hmm. up to it on their sophomore thing. Yeah, I took a lot of steps, man. I listened to a lot of stuff, you know, people like Jay-Z, DMX, all them coming off. I'm competitive. I, I love what they do. Red man, all them, I mean, and then my own people on my label, you know, I mean, <laughs> P and all them, I mean, so I listened to all that. Then I just decided to go to L.A. and get away from everything. I don't want to be bothered with nobody, no, no problems, no nothing, and just concentrating on that. And that's what I did, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I dealt with the heavy hitters, listened to their stuff, and yeah. said, you know what, I got to get on that level. And sure that's why did. I took it, you know? Now, with the beats, with the beats, you got your boy, uh, from Beats by the Pan. For sure. And y'all got down together, correct? For sure. You explain, know that. Explain, explain the whole. Mm, man, it's like Beats by the Pound. I can't do it. I, I don't even want to do music, like I said in one of my songs. If it ain't Beats by the Pound, I don't want to do it. And I mean, I don't mind working with other, like I work with Mark in the Dark, one of the Snoop people out there. Gave me one of the tightest songs, you know, I've heard in a while. But it's just, you know what I'm saying? I'm just, I just love Beats by the Pound. It's just they sound, it's just everything. And KL is my man, right. you know, who I started out with. And I always made a promise, you know, we gonna always roll together, no matter what. You gonna come first before anybody when it comes to Beats. And now it's like five of them, so all them come first. As when it comes to me, I'm gonna deal with them first before I go to outside well, producers. Well, you all, you all were friends before y'all got hooked up. Oh, no limit. yes indeed, man. All we had between us was honey buns and ruffles and five dollars in our pocket, dog. You can't get no deeper than that. Sure, can you know what I'm honey saying? Buns and that's and the small bag of ruffles, baby. The little bag, twenty-five you know, cents. For sure, man. It's only about three potato chips in this up. For real. <laughs> Why are you making fun of my ruffles? Dog? My bad, my bad. <laughs> what? You got your thoughts together. You got your beats together. What's the other ingredient that was needed to make, to give it the push to say, all right, let's make it hot? It's a big problem, baby. My single, my boy, you know what I'm saying? He, I have so much respect for him, not just because Terror Squad is about to blow up. They the, they the bomb, you know, Cuban Link, Prospect, all them, Fat Joe. Right. But, you know, doing a video shoot in New York, first No Limit Artist to do a video in New York, you know, he had a broken foot, everything, dude, and he was out there handling his business. See, most rappers don't, you know, right. they all left for the fame and glory. You know, he was there to take care of business and be there. You know what I'm saying? Right. And, you know, I told him I wanted to do something with him months before. Called him. He said, let's do it. We got the business part out the way. And, you know what I mean? It's doing its thing from NY to NO. NY to NO. Y'all stay tuned. It's Joe Cleese and Mr. Servo chilling at Servo House when I'm just making myself at home. We'll be back yeah. in a minute. Yeah. Let me have that flat. Love it.